What's up, YouTube? It's Thank You 213 with IntactTheSneakerBox.com here at Rare Footage. About to review the Fusion Laser 4s. They came out a couple weeks ago, uh, but I'm just getting to it. It's a good shoe overall. Uh, they took the concept from the regular Air Jordan 4s. They had the white and the black ones. Right now, they only dropped the white ones so far. I haven't seen the white one. If they are going to drop it or not, I don't know. So here they are. They changed it up um, a lot from the from the regular Jordan 4 laser. I'll go over that, starting with the outsole. It's gray with black accents. It's a Fusion 4, so it's incorporating things from the Air Force 1 and the Air Jordan 4. The midsole is a translucent Air Force midsole. Like a, it's supposed to be black, but it's got a blue tint to it. Then red inside the air bubble. The whole upper is a black suede with that laser print in it with all the, the Jordans. You can see like a 16, 16, 9, stuff like that everywhere. A lot of detail. Now, on the one, the original Air Jordan 4, not the original, but the, the first laser that released, it was leather, not suede. So that was one of the differences. Then the black mesh, the black waffle tab, red laces going all the way up to red inside. We have the Jordan 4 tab up on the tongue, black nubuck. Gray waffles matching the gray on the back with the red jump mat. Uh, red insole with the black jump man. Then the black dubre with the jump man and the Air Force One. Retail on these is 150. You can get them here at Rare Footage. It's definitely a good shoe um, in place of the regular Jordan 4 laser because those go for a hefty amount of money. Under the tongue, best of both worlds. It's upside down matching the Air Jordan 4, that, which usually says Air Jordan upside down, which is cool in that cursive. So that's it. Stay tuned. We have a lot more to come. See you guys later.